Thessaloniki is a metropolis beckoning you to traverse so its breadth at all times, adorned with leafy boulevards and an energetic ambiance. The heart of the city is Aristoteles Square, offering a seaside panorama and numerous coffee shops, ideal for observing passersby. Enriched with cultural heritage, the city is renowned for its gastronomy, dynamic nightlife, and outgoing residents. So let's explore the top activities in Thessaloniki and commence your vacation in Greece's warm and welcoming northern city. Discover the top eight coveted activities in Thessaloniki. Number one, the White Tower. The iconic bleached round waterfront tower is the emblem of the city. The tower's history is as vibrant as Thessaloniki itself. Having once been a part of the city's Byzantine and Ottoman fortifications, before most of these walls were leveled in the late 19th century. During the era of Ottoman control, it functioned as a prison and a torture site, earning it the grim moniker of the Tower of Blood. In an effort to make amends for its dark past, the edifice was metaphorically whitewashed and rechristened as the White Tower. Even though its current hue is closer to beige, it still holds onto its name today. Presently, the inside of the White Tower operates as a comprehensive museum that depicts everyday life across various epochs in Thessaloniki. Alongside a range of artifacts, the third floor houses a reconstruction of a typical Byzantine era, dwelling complete with period-appropriate furniture. Number two, the waterfront. As you wander around the antiquated seafront, the blending of history and modernity in the atmosphere will captivate you. Starting from the port storage facilities and progressing down Nikos Avenue, the journey leads you to the White Tower. As you traverse, you encounter families, cyclists, and pairs, and the noise of street sellers peddling sunflower seeds fills the air. Yet, the sight of the Thermaic Gulf during sundown is unsurpassed. Number three, Camara Rotunda, the Arch of Galerius in Thessaloniki a victorious emblem from the 4th century AD, is part of an architectural assembly encompassing the rotunda and the grand complex at Navarino Square. Fast forward to the present day, the region now termed Camara is predominantly occupied by students who are a significant demographic in Thessaloniki. It's an essential stop on any citywide walking tour and is worth lingering. Study breaks are punctuated with vibrant student debates over coffee, a thriving bar scene, and frequent trips to tattoo parlors. Youngsters strum guitars and enjoy beers next to the ancient ruins, lending a local Barceloneta vibe to the area. Where else could you witness an archeological site so seamlessly blending into a city's contemporary rhythm? Number four. Agios Dimitrios Church. The grand church that stands today was constructed on the grounds of an old Roman bath. According to folklore, this is the location where Saint Demetrius, after whom the church is named, was imprisoned, executed, and thrown down a well by Roman warriors. The architectural design includes five aisles and a unique hexagonal central area, otherwise known as a ciborium. A notable feature within this church is a renowned six-part mural, one of Thessaloniki's best examples of mosaic artistry. It depicts Saint Demetrius in the company of children and the architects of the building. Not only is this one of the largest religious structures in the city, but it holds significant historical and spiritual value for all of Thessaloniki. Number five, pulsating nightlife. In Thessaloniki, there's always another tavern waiting for you. The city pulses with life as melodies fill the air and libations keep pouring. Whether you prefer a place with an old world charm or a cutting edge vibe, a 1920s speakeasy or a modern club, Thessaloniki's after dark scene is brimming with pioneering establishments, catering to every preference. Number six, Monument of Alexander the Great. Thessaloniki is a city that's rich in historical sites worth visiting. One of the noteworthy landmarks is the Grand Monument of Alexander the Great, which is a crucial stop for anyone touring the city. 
This monument is situated at the Nea Paralia Promenade, along the city's waterfront. It was crafted by the renowned artist Evangelos Mustakas in 1974 as a tribute to one of the most significant military commanders in history, Alexander the Great. The imposing bronze figure, about six meters high, magnificently represents the famous king atop his horse, Bucephalus. Tourists at the monument have the opportunity to utilize its prime location for capturing memorable photos. The breathtaking sea views from Thessaloniki's waterfront make an idyllic setting for the statue. Number seven, Aristoteles Square. The primary city plaza was initially conceived in 1918 by the French architect Ernest Hebrard. However, a significant portion of the current square, including the Electra Hotel and the Cinema House, underwent a transformation in the 1950s. This shift was a departure from the narrow, congested, haphazardly laid out streets that were a product of centuries of Ottoman Empire constructions towards a more contemporary layout under Hebrard's supervision. The plaza materialized shortly after a devastating fire in 1917, signifying a substantial turn in the city's archaeological progression. Nowadays, the square serves as a central location for numerous festivities and public assemblies. Number eight, suites like Bugatze. While visiting Thessaloniki, you may prioritize discovering its rich array of cultural landmarks. However, there's an experience that might linger in your memory even more vividly. The local delicacies, featuring buffalo cream and ultra-thin phyllo pastry, are divine. As the day progresses, even the younger demographic tends to gravitate toward the city's bakeries and patisseries, 